Hi, everybody. It's Michael Fisher. Sorry for the lack of an official intro, but we have a Lumia 1020 review to finish and an episode of the Pocket Now Weekly to record. But before the weekend starts, we needed to get our hands on this device. This is the HTC 8 XT for Sprint, one of the first Windows phones on Sprint in a long time. The I believe the first Windows Phone 8 device on Sprint and certainly the first Windows Phone 8 device with boom sound from HTC. So let's have a look at the specs on the outside of the box there. 8 megapixel camera, 1.4 gigahertz dual core processor, and of course LTE. This packaging 100% recyclable and definitely feels like it. Uh, Unlike AT&T's boxes, which are just kind of unremarkable, the Sprint box is remarkable because it feels like a TV dinner box or something. But it is 100% recyclable and good for Sprint for uh, going green. So let's go ahead and pop the flap on the box open. I just want to get right to the device here. Not just because we're low on time, wow, but because we are actually pretty interested in seeing this phone. It's always nice when a carrier uh, has neglected a platform for a while and uh, then comes back to it. In this case, of course, Windows Phone. Pull it out of the package. Wow, a little bit heavier than I would expect coming out of the package. We'll put it aside for just one second. Look at that color. That's pretty cool. Let's see what's in the box here. Power adapter. The same earbuds. If you missed these on our unboxing for a uh, for the Google Edition HTC One, uh, or I think even the Sprint Edition HTC One, these earbuds were included with some extra gels here. They are not Beats branded but uh, they are red and black. Let me put those aside. There's our USB cable power adapter, nothing special there. A getting started guide to everything encased in uh, this kind of very, very soft plastic. It feels, I don't know, it feels weird. And more HTC stickers for our collection to put on the back of our zip cars and tell everyone that we love HTC. Uh, if you do, if you do feel that way or you do not have to use them at all. Let's take this out of its packaging once we understand the location privacy concerns. Sprint wants us to understand. And wow. Wow, indeed. So this is a soft touchback here uh, with a nice dual tone color arrangement. They both, both zones feel the same way. This is soft touch pan on each side. There's that eight megapixel camera with LED flash, the Beats audio call out, HTC branding there. Side buttons are plastic, just like on the uh, the standard 8X. Dual stage camera key there, also plastic. Up top, you've got your, if we can stay in focus, your power standby and your 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. Nothing on that side. And micro USB. Look at that. It looks, you know, it appears fatter on camera than it actually is. I'm sure the dimensions don't differ significantly from the standard 8X. We turn it around. And there is the front side. Love this dual tone thing going on. It looks like it looks almost as though a um, an HTC 8S and an 8X got together and uh, formed an offspring uh, in a good way. And boom sound, unlike on the traditional HTC One, with its uh, with its grills, symmetrical grills, top and bottom, we have a larger earpiece segment and a smaller one down below. Be very interesting to see if there's any performance difference as a result of that phone. You know, soft touch paint just does a great job of making a phone feel really nice. I mean, I know it's not anything new. It's been around for, you know, six or seven years at this point. We've been painting the backsides of phones with this soft touch stuff to make it easier to grip. But this definitely feels quite nice. A bit of a far cry from the, uh, the Lumia 1020 here, which is uh, just that matte polycarbonate. Uh, which also feels great, but it's just smooth and slippery, and this isn't. This doesn't feel like it's going to leave your your palm at all. There's that big old HTC clock widget, and otherwise the typical Windows start screen. So, folks, thank you for watching our very quick unboxing and uh, very cursory hardware tour of the HTC 8XT for Sprint. We are going to be taking uh, a close look at this device in the coming days. So, stay tuned to Pocket Now, and we'll talk to you soon.